Hi everyone. Let's solve question number forty-five. If f(x) equals to sine of this and h(x) equals to cos of this, then this complicated expression equals. So let's try to write this first. First, so one by two h of x by phi. So h(x) equals to cos of log ten x. So h of x by y would be cos of log ten x by y. So that would be cos of log ten x by y. And plus h of x x y that would be cos of log 10 xy so this is the first expression so let's try to simplify this one let's take log 10x as a and log 10y as b so this would become 1 by 2 times with the help of property of log we can write this as log 10x minus log 10y right so basically cos of a minus b right because cos a is log 10x and cos uh, and b is log 10y plus cos of log 10xy and with the help of property of log we can write this as log of log 10 of x plus log 10 of y so that would be cos of a plus b so that would be 1 by 2 that is cos a cos b plus sin a sin b and that would be cos a cos b minus sin a sin b so plus sin a sin b and minus sin a sin b get cancel out So this would become two times cos of cos a dot cos b, right? So two gets cancelled out. So this becomes cos a dot cos b, right? Now let us simplify the second term. So that is f x dot f y. So f x equals to sine of log ten x. So basically sine a. So that would become sine a dot sine b. With the minus sign because we have minus f x dot f y over here, right? So basically, the entire expression becomes cos a cos b minus sine a sine b, right? So this is the entire expression. So this is nothing but cos of a plus b, right? So a is log 10 x, b is log 10 y, and with the help of property, we can write this as cos of log 10 x y. so a is the correct answer